Hello, my budgeting friends. How are you? I hope each and every single one of you is doing wonderful today. I am drinking my coffee in my little ghost cup. Here's a cheers to you. Thank you for joining me for another video today. I have some exciting things to share. It will not be a long video, but thank you so much for spending some time with me today. I have new subscribers, new friends out there. Welcome to my returning friends and my new ones. This is Managing Mona's Mula, and I am Mona. This new channel is all about bi-weekly paycheck budgeting, cash stuffing, my savings challenges, and my cash envelopes, my sinking funds, and my personal mission of paying off my mortgage early so that I can retire early. So the lender of my mortgage finally corrected their information and I was able to see my extra payment affect my principal balance so it has decreased. So I am very, very happy to share the new number with all of you today. So first of all, though, I have an extra $40 that I did not have a couple of hours ago. So this is new money that I didn't plan for. It did not come from my paycheck. So this is a blessing. So what I'm going to do is stuff my 100 envelope challenge with this money. And then we'll get into my new mortgage balance, okay? So I do have $40, so let's get to stuffing. This is a 100 envelope challenge box that I did get from Monica. Her name is Monica over on Etsy and her Etsy shop is called Dark Lovely Budgets. So I got this beautiful savings box and all the wonderful, beautiful little envelopes. Each one is different. So if we take a look at this one here for 75, isn't that pretty? This has to be my favorite. Um, it's the 100 envelope. See how pretty those fuchsias and purples are on the trees. She calls this um, her mystery tree series, I believe. I got this some time back. So thank you, Monica, over on Etsy for my 100 envelope savings box. So I am going to color in my card with $40 and stuff my envelope. So let's just get right into this. How is everybody doing out there? I hope everybody is doing fantastic. See the one for 40, isn't that pretty? So I have $40 I'm going to stuff today. If I can get it to stuff in there. <laughs> Let's see if I could get it in there. Nope, let's see. Let's try this way. Okay, money, get in there. There we go. So that's 40. And I am going to color this in with the number 40. If I can find it on this little card. I apologize for the glare. Let's see where that 40 is. Here it is. Little by little, right? Little by little, I'll get this little card filled in. It's gonna take me forever. <laughs> okay, so yay, I got to stuff something in my 100 envelope savings box. 
All right, so yes, I'm so excited. The lender finally corrected the error. I had to call them and ask them to correct their mistake. They have. So my goal was met. I was able to make an extra payment to my principal. This was a goal. And so my new mortgage balance is now 87, 972 and 65 cents. Back on April the 5th, My mortgage balance was $99,976.98. So I am aggressively paying this down as quickly as I can. Let's see how much I have paid since April the 5th. 99,976, 98 minus today's balance of 87,972. 65. So I have paid $12,004.33 since April the 5th. It has not been easy. It's been a sacrifice. But if I continue on my path to achieve my goal, I'll eventually get there. I just have to be patient. So since I've paid $12,004.33, I have to take a look at that number 12. That is how many balloons I should have colored in at this moment. There are 100 balloons on this page. Each balloon is worth $1,000. Every time I pay $1,000 against this balance, I get to color in another balloon. So I'm going to count how many I have so far and see if I get to color in another balloon. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11. So I get to color in another balloon for the month of October towards this little page bringing me closer to my goal of being mortgage free. So which one will it be today? I think I'm going to color in this one way over here. How is everybody doing? Are you saving money? Are you surviving out there? I was watching some videos on YouTube on inflation and it is really a very sad state of affairs because the groceries are so expensive, the gas is over $4 a gallon. There are a lot of people that are really struggling and my heart goes out to them so we have to be grateful for all the blessings that we have. I am very grateful. I thank God for everything that I have. So that concludes this segment of my mortgage update. But I wanted to share the good news. So I have two more months in the calendar year. I have November and December. Let's see how much further I can get towards decreasing this. My goal is around 83,500. 83, we'll see if I even get there. I don't know. It's just a goal. We'll, <laughs> I'll try, right? <laughs> That's all I can do is try. <laughs> so with that, I am going to close and I want to wish each of you a very blessed day. I wish you all peace. 
I wish you all happiness. Thank you for spending time with me today. Have a wonderful day or night, wherever you're at. Thank you for tuning in.